This might actually be the best month of sneaker releases this entire year. So let's go ahead and get started with the first shoe. We have the Air Jordan 4 Military Blue. Now you saw these and we did the ranking video already. Right. So I'm gonna pull them out again so you can check them out. And uh, these are set to come out in a couple days actually. What do you think about the shoe? Is it a cop? Is it a drop? What's going on? How you feel? No, this is a cop. You have to have this in your collection. If you don't get this in your collection, you just... You know something else. So, <laughs> it's an interesting in hand, place this. with this shoe because right. the market, this shoe was like six, seven, eight hundred dollars right? Right. Early. Right. Early pairs. You know, everybody want to be first. They right. pay extra, right? Okay. They did shock drop. They did something else. Next thing you know, the price is like 300 Right. And then it's like the, the release week, and now it's like 250 Huh? It's going down? Retail is like 200 bucks, right? <laughs> So, people are like, all this hype around the shoe, but then when it comes out, is it gonna sit? Originally, it was selling four times the value, whatever you wanna say, and now it's like, is this shoe gonna sit? I think it might sit in select sizes in certain cities. But, here's what I got to say, and I've been saying this, it's Nike's fault. Air Jordan brand, Nike, all of them, it's mm -hmm. your fault. If these <laughs> shoes are sitting, it's your fault, because, you're coming out with too many shoes. If you release a shoe, you gotta keep it limited. Right. I'm gonna give a number. They used to do 100,000 pair, now they're doing 300,000 pair. A million, two million. I'm just giving a number. Crazy. So if you guys know what I'm talking yeah. about. So you, they increased it. Yeah. And when you increase it, then you make it too accessible to everybody. And then they go, well, I don't want it. Cause everybody can get it. There's they're a, killing their own market. There, there's a, a a thing about buying what you like, but then at the same time, you don't like seeing everybody, everybody with it. You, you know what I'm saying? And that doesn't mean it should deter you from not buying the shoe, but at the same time, but it, you know how, you know what I'm saying? Like when you've been It's in the like the price for 300 when it came out. <laughs> everybody bought the price for 300 and everybody then it became weak. Car. The value went down, the resale value went down. You couldn't do nothing with the car. Nobody yep. wants the car. Yep. Yep. That's a great Just example. Just think about it. Yep. You, 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 Nike, Jordan brand, you guys are killing your own market. If well, y'all ever see this stuff. It's hard though, because again, they got to hit their numbers. They got to keep their jobs. They got to, they're in the yeah, stock but, market. But you know what I'm saying? They got to hit these numbers and their stock is not looking too good. But the shoes, which is a whole other conversation. Stuff, all this stuff is built on one thing. Mm -hmm. That's the hype and accessibility. And a culture drives it. Yeah. We drive this stuff. And if you have, if I walk, you've done videos. I know we got other shoes to talk about, but yeah, yeah we gotta hurry up. But I gotta make this real quick. You've done videos when a shoe come out and we go to a sneaker con or we go to the mall, everybody is wearing the shoe. Right. So Nike, they done their job. But what kills it is the future part of that shoe. It doesn't sell. Right. And so more people start going, I don't want it. So they're not looking for it. They're not going to go to the store. And right. that's why they're sitting on shelves. Yeah. That first push works. Yeah. Then after the first push, it's sitting on shelves. So it kind of diminishes from a classic legendary model mm -hmm. in a situation like this where they built up a lot of hype around the Air Jordan 4 in particular. Yeah. And then we got this OG colorway. Finally, first the time. Cuts, on the everything. Yeah. I've done a full review. We need right. to take it to the next shoe. Let's just go to the next shoe. But year. I'm just saying. So either way, it's a cop. It's a cop. You got to have it. It's a cop. I'm doubling up for sure. This is my I'm a single, single pair. up. <laughs> I got my first pair. I need a second pair for I'm sure. getting one in a row. <laughs> okay, next up right here, we have the Sidewalk Chalk Air Jordan Tatum 2. Inspired by Sidewalk Chalk, the different colors, right. you rinse it away, it kind of goes together. So like I've bashed the Tatums. They came out some weird colors. Okay. Ironically enough, I actually like this one. This one's cool. I actually like this one. The colors is cool. It, okay, <sighs> so you haven't seen a Tatum in person yet. No. Jordan Brand family, shout out to Jordan Brand family. Uh -oh. They sent over a pair oh, for me dude. to test these out, see how they hoop and everything. Now you can also tell me what you think about the shoe in person. In hand, I like the shoe. I've always said the style of the shoe mm -hmm. is cool. I'm glad they didn't go super low with the low tops like they're doing the Kobe's and all that mm -hmm. stuff because I'm, I'm not a low top fan on that. But the style of the shoe, it, the cuts, everything. Oh, excuse me. Everything about it mm -hmm. is dope. I think I think it's a good looking shoe. I like uh, that. 
the colorway, way. I'm always like, eh. but I think yeah. it's a cool shoe to hoop in too. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like yeah. I'm not going nowhere crazy. I'm just hooping at 24 with the homies. Like it's nothing crazy. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Just something light. <laughs> so I'm excited to hoop these. I'll give you guys my review of these later after I get done hooping them. No, it's we just a, been in and out of town. Definitely, and we're out of town again. <laughs> yeah, we got Boston coming up. But either way, uh, sidewalk chalk. Tatum 2s, this is the same model, just a different colorway. I just wanted you to see yeah. it in person yeah. and in hand. I definitely like that colorway yeah. better. I like the purple one But too. again, I kind of I kind of bashed just a little bit, but in hand, because I was talking about this color, yeah. and this is like a green, right? Mm -hmm. So You know I'm colorblind. But this threw me off in yeah. that shoe. I got you. Right? But otherwise than that, I'm like, I'm good. It's The style is cool. Yeah, I'm looking forward to hooping these. Thank you, Jordan Brand family. Appreciate you guys as always. Now, next time, send a 14, yes. Jordan Brand family. <laughs> <laughs> we know how this works. <laughs> Help a brother out when he down. <laughs> All, right. All right, next up right here, we have the Air Jordan 1 Low OG Shadow. Retail is gonna be 140 bucks. They've done a shock drop on the shoe already, and they're set to drop now uh, for me. It's an instant cop. I low key might double up on these. This is what I just said. Right now, they're batting good. This is rare that they've been batting like this right now. All three shoes is nice. I, th I think this is the I think this, this is, is the best this month. This is the so best far. month so far. Y'all doing good. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Doing good. So OG Shadow High. I love it. We've seen retro versions of the Shadow Low before, but either way, I know for a fact. This is a great shoe, yeah. and I just, I'm gonna tear these up. Like, I already right. know I need to tear. See it. Like, all the other lows that I've gotten, the right. black toes, the different ones, whatever you name it, like, I've double up, triple up, because yeah. they're heavy in the rotation. As soon as I, I might not even lace them up. Might be the same just, situation just, before. Just, just put them on. Just, just, <laughs> no no relaxes, put them on. Board. <laughs> so, definitely a cop for it's me. Definitely a cop but for me, too. One thing I can say is, what? I think they might be already going for under the retail value. That's dope. I have to check the price. So it's if so, this up. is one of those like catch it on sale type sneakers. But this is going to be one that's going later up. It's going to go up. It's going to go up in value later. But at the same time, you might be able to get these for under 140 bucks. So for the people out there, I would say be patient because I'm definitely going to be patient when it comes to the release on these. But I will have two pairs at the end of the day. And if it goes up, it'll probably take like two years or something, maybe three, but it's definitely going to go up. It's going to go up. It's a classic. Yeah. You can't go wrong with it. It's for sure. Like, there's no way that couldn't be a $250 shoe or something like that. Like, that's really right. not that crazy price. Right. Like, yeah. And it's, you know, oh, I got it for $140. Now it's worth $100 more. Like, it's a great shoe. Hey, yo, just real quick, I wanted to let you guys know we got a bunch of new merch on the website, shopdnashow.com. Also, you guys can click on any of the links of the product tag just below the video here if you're watching on your mobile devices. I can't wait to see you guys rocking the gear. Whenever you cop something, make sure you post it on IG so I can see it, and then I'll repost it. All right, let's get back to the video. This one, I'm hyped about. So I'm excited because they've been doing all these earth tone stuff and everything. And then this is Travis Scott, Air Jordan 1 Low. This is Elkins. So this is around his high school, his this high school crazy. colors, everything like that. These are dope. So, Problem is, what? it's a women's sizing. Bah! So it's going to be crazy <laughs> expensive in our size. They'll never come out my size, dude. They but, will, but they're going to be expensive. But I will say right now they're four for four. They're hitting crazy right now so y'all better get your money ready because this is going to go <laughs> down this month <laughs> it's going down this, this is month. for sure a cop i know for a fact i'm gonna find my way to get this shoe uh yeah i'm i'm gonna be buying a lot i'd of really like the shoe I, I wouldn't get it but i really like the shoe you wouldn't rock those with the gum bottom on there no, too? no i'm not gonna be able to get wear 14. but you but if you were able to acquire the shoe oh i would get it. it okay yeah yeah okay, i would okay, rock okay. it yeah for sure Okay. But I'm just saying I'm a 14. I have a highly chance of me getting something like that. No, that's like a woman 16 or something. No, uh, 15 and a half. No. Yeah. <laughs> yep. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see what happens when the time comes. But, but way, they are doing better in the WNBA, so they might start picking up bigger feet. Yeah. This is uh, one of, I think, the most hyped releases of the year as well, I would mm -hmm, say, for mm -hmm. the most part. I think that and then the new, this shoe, which we'll get into a little bit later in the video. This is the yeah. Travis uh new his new model this is i really like the model. Model too. we'll talk about these in a second but this shoe this collaboration this colorway something different something bright something vibrant more similar to the I almost the would change them, them uh shoe laces to the color of the switch they got they usually come with multiple laces so you probably yeah. get wax laces they'll probably give you like red white yellow see oh yeah yeah yellow. yeah yeah you got yeah so you got Ooh. you got all the colors you need 
uh, to that go over it. But you know how like the blue forest, they just pop. Like I think this is that same thing. Right. You got that yellow just really popping with that suede. I think it's gonna be a dope shoe. Uh, a cop for a lot of people, but it's gonna not it's not gonna be an easy cop for a lot right, of people. Right. Next up right here, we talked about these before. Oh no, I gotta have those. Space Jam Air Jordan 11 low. <laughs> have we talked about these twice already? Or yeah, once? it didn't come out or something. They keep getting pushed back. I'm wearing my other ones that's similar to those today. Okay. You know I'll be rocking the those. The 7210 lows. Yeah, yeah you be I'll rocking be those. Rocking okay. This right here, I'm on the fence. I Why? think I think because I'm buying all this other stuff, I'm like I might, I might grab these later or something. Maybe catch a used yeah. pair for a low or something, you know? Nah. Like worn ones or something, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I don't know. I'm kind of right there. I wouldn't, I, I'm not I'm not rushing out to get these. I'd be rushing out to get those. Okay. Like, okay. me, because you know, I really mess with them 11. 190 bucks? I'm waiting for a little bit to see if the price goes down. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I I'm was saying. I was thinking like, like buck 50. I, I don't know. I just, I got a feeling like, these might see it, you know what I'm saying? Ooh. You might be able to, you might let it go down. A we saw bit. the gratitude 11s, the white and black high top with the gold, remember? Yeah, then was sitting. Yeah, so if then was sitting, it's crazy. You don't think how, these wouldn't be sitting, but I know I'm possibly, yes, like take the bias out of it and think about like what's gonna happen. But that's what I'm saying, it's just hard because me, I really like 11s. These are fire. Mm -hmm. No, these are gonna end up in my collection, it just it might not be like. Right when they come out for 190 bucks. Cause you know the other saying? one we got is like that, but in a high top. Yeah, the real Space Jam, the high top one. Yeah. Now, <laughs> continuing on with the fire. We got the J Balvins. You seen the, the tan pair over there. Now they're doing the blackout version. They're like. Every shoe is fire. <laughs> they are batty right now. They are batty. <laughs> so, 250 retail, crazy shoe. I saw these in person. When, oh, oh, you saw them? God. Remember when we was in yeah. Miami? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you saw them when we was out in Miami. So, I saw these a few months ago. Great shoe. Uh, man. Man, man, This man. is crazy. I think these are fire. I like the first pair. I know I'm going like, to love the second somebody's pair. Somebody's not paying their mortgage or they rent this much. <laughs> they gonna be even if you bought all the shoes for retail, like it's, it's still, gonna be hidden. <laughs> Cause you about buck seventy if you average the price. No, it's like one seventy, one eighty per. These are two fifty. Oh, so that is two dollars. One ninety yeah. lowest retail price now is like one ninety. So, yeah, so even, it's a one. yeah, not one ninety. You got six pair or something straight. Yeah, yeah. So either Down way, 12, we cashing out. <laughs> I'm getting all this well, stuff. <laughs> these go crazy. Yeah, these go I'm crazy. I want some extra lines. So these are these are selling for like a rack right now or something like that oh, to get them early. I think it might be a little bit cheaper. I don't remember. You guys, when they come out early, if you can get them early, just wait. And then that way you don't have to pay so much extra. Yeah, yeah. You see this sample pair? You see how it's got the lighter elephant print? That's yeah. the pair that we saw when we was in Miami. Yeah, yeah. The new, the general release pair. a darker charcoal. Got the darker, yep. yeah. But either way. I like the darker though better. Yeah, no, it blends well with the shoe. Yeah. Great uh, sneaker. Oof, yeah, I'm looking forward to that. Now this one. What are one, they doing? This is a good shoe. This is a really good shoe, <laughs> but I'm gonna pass on this one. No! I'm for sure passing. The 12? Red Taxi Air Jordan 12. So the Taxi 12s. Right. Typically black and white, they added a splash of red in there and they called them the red taxis. And for me, I'm like, no, I'm good. So yeah, this is one of them shoes. It's like, it's going to come out now, 200 bucks. You might catch it on a retail. Or I want to catch it on sale and on retail. Right. And then later down the line, you're yeah, like, go why is this shoe 350? Why is this shoe 325? Yeah. Like, it's going to be one of those situations. It's going to take some years, but it's going to happen. It's going to happen. You know, the, way, the market's going to recover all the different stuff. Like, yeah. it's going to happen. So. I can understand why someone might buy and hold it or whatever if you can afford to do that. But for me, just the long haul, having it, enough 12s in the collection and everything else, it's a pass. That's all I'm you saying. You don't need one more pair of shoes? If I was like just <laughs> getting started collecting, right. I would go crazy for these. Right. But when you have multiple pairs of 12s alone, just all the colorways that look so He got somewhere. like 100 pairs of shoes now. <laughs> yeah, just <No>. 100. <laughs> in that corner. <laughs> Okay, They're like how many behind us? <laughs> <laughs> right, that's like, <laughs> that's like 130 or something right. like that. Okay, so uh, what we got over here? Okay, so this is a women's release. So we saw the mocha mm -hmm. ones. This is the latte version. So it's like, like a creamy. lighter, creamier, mm -hmm. 180 retail. Great looking oh, that's shoe. That's clean. It's clean. I heard it's a women's release in the sizing. Man. Um, but. I might be going after these. I think I might go after these. But I also think 
that they're gonna sit and you're gonna be able to get them for a good price. Why you because, think women don't buy the shoes like men? No, just because all the ones, nobody cares about them anymore. Yeah, they, they have been coming down a little bit on the ones. I just got these and I love these by the way. That's almost the same shoe. Well, this is, what color is this? That's tan. This <laughs> is <It's> green. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't this tan, you guys? No. This is the shoe that you was having no. troubles with last time. <laughs> it's called Green Glow. It's a, it's like minty green, like bright as hell. <laughs> I was close. He said, "That's tan." This is tan. <laughs> he like that looked like the same shoe. Trust me, it's not <laughs> at all. <laughs> Either way, I was so excited about grabbing these. Like that's green. <laughs> that's, that's green. <laughs> Yes, this is green. Okay, but, okay. But this shoe right here, like, they had a little bit of hype on the shock drop, and mm -hmm. then after the release came, they just sat, mm -hmm. and they're mm -hmm. still sitting. Yeah. And I think just the way ones are, this is a great time to but be a sneakerhead. But it's sitting because it's green. No. If it was tan, it'd probably be better. Okay, we'll see. Nah, we'll see. We'll see. <clears throat> I just think either way, at the end of the day, it's a they, great time they, to be a People sneaker have head. been coming down on the ones, and that's part of the problem that Jordan been doing, Jordan Brand them them been yeah. doing. It's just flooding the market with the ones because they won so long on it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, speaking of that, I got another shoe too. Grab that one. That box. I know you already say, seen it. Yeah. I'll pick these up. <laughs> this is the unfortunate. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted these. You found it? Oh my God! Y'all gonna see me a sneaker con, Jazz? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you again. Oh my God! Oh, like I said, oh. great shoes right now. It's what a color great is time it? to be. That's no. <laughs> it's a great time to be a sneakerhead. That's all I'm saying. Oh. There's some great models, oh some my classics, God. some good these? colorways. Oh, I wanted these so bad. <laughs> like, and then I. And then oh. I <sighs> Oh my God, <laughs> you hook a brother up. Y'all just don't even know how happy I am. <laughs> I can't wait to see the oh. fit. <laughs> oh my God. I gotta lead this right here. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's take it to the next shoe. <laughs> oh. Right here. So this shoe, Jordan wore this shoe. Uh -huh. And this is the Air Jordan 17 Low Lightning. He wore that this at is the end of his career? Uh, yeah, for the Wizards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's actually a picture right here. Yeah. Okay, so you had the high top, you had the low top, and then there was like kind of like a mid, I or you want to consider this it. Over there. <laughs> I'm, okay, I'm back, I'm back. I was thinking about that. <laughs> <laughs> there was like uh, basically like a high, a low, and a mid kind of situation. There was like two different types of highs. Mm -hmm. Uh, but basically, this version we had never seen come out with a briefcase. So right. I got the briefcase for like my OG Jordan 17, the white and blue colorway, cause uh -huh. those came with the briefcase, the black pair, and then the uh, white and reds and different stuff like that. So people were like interested with this whole like briefcase concept and then the 17's coming back out and there's a lot of hype around it. But the retail price, what 300. You, 300 is the retail. Yeah. So they charge you for that case. That briefcase. They hit you for like a hundred for the briefcase. For the briefcase. <laughs> so, but either way, uh, there's a lot of hype around it but I feel like it's from certain collectors. But at the same time, I don't think they're gonna make a lot of pairs. So it's gonna be one of those hard to get That would releases. be smart. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I think this is one of those like, not everybody wants it, but the people that do, they're gonna go after it and there's not mm -hmm. gonna be a crazy amount. So then it's gonna be like kind of a struggle to get the shoe and you might have to pay extra. You might end up spending uh, 400 bucks or 375 or something like that right. to get it from somebody to make sure you lock in the size or something. So. But that's that's kind of where we're at with it, but that's I know, smart with that. If they if they flood the market, yeah, forget it. For me, 100% cop. Yeah, 100%. This is no brainer. For me, no. No cop. No, because I'm aware. And $300, I don't know. Yeah. I kind of, you know what I was thinking? Because I don't care about the briefcase. Like you got, you know what I was thinking? The, 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 you saving everything in that. Right. Way. No, no, no. I want to wear these. I wear my Bibby 17s. I didn't say you don't. I will wear these. I know you do. And it got a black bottom. I know it. That's even better. <laughs> so, but this is what I was thinking. What? What if <clears throat> I had the, this This is a fabric material around the ankle. Uh -huh. What if I took it to embroider and had them do my name on the side like a PE? 
No, that would be crazy. That would be hard. That would take it to another level. That would be hard. I'm thinking about it. I just gotta find somebody to do it with. Yeah, I would take it to That'd be hard. Level. And just turn it into my own PE. Right. I think it's I think it's possible. Jordan to do it. Brain, y'all owe him a shoe anyway. <sighs> he gotta get his own shoe. We'll Let talk him about that later. No. We'll talk about that later. We gotta figure out what number. He won a six. Six. Let yeah, him let him design a six. I want a six for sure. Okay, next one. Just two hundred thousand pairs. That's it. Just two hundred. That's not too much. Mm -mm. <laughs> okay. I'm putting it in the air. <laughs> the pixie, sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. the pixie does. <laughs> okay, 170 bucks. Air Jordan Spizike Low. This is lightning. So those were the lightning. Have, have they had a bad shoe yet? I'm telling you. I this, don't think they had a bad shoe yet. This is the yet. best month. This is the best month of the year. Those are. Ooh, These go crazy. God. These go crazy. This, for me, this is a must cop. Okay. So like. Again, very vibrant shoe. You think of the Travis Scott low, you think of these, like really poppy, you know what I'm right. saying? Like that color is crazy. I think these are like dope. Like on foot, like. Yes. But at the same time, I'm not spending 170 for those. Like, it's Why not? not? I'm not spending 170 for those. They're definitely worth 170. Is it translucent household? It is. That's it good. is. It's gonna yellow, get dirty <laughs> over time. But it's gonna yellow like the shoe. Yeah, but then it's gonna be like pissy on the bottom. It's oh. gonna be a different type of yellow. No. It's gonna be a dehydrated. Look at the materials on here. Yeah, no, this is a great shoe. Look at the materials. I think, I think a lot of people are gonna get something different, unique, something cool, affordable, all these different boxes that you can check. I think that's gonna come from this shoe right here. Yes. This shoe is bananas to me. 170. Okay. That's worth 170. Last but not least, the final one on the list, we have the Travis Scott Jumpman Jack University Red. So we're gonna run through some photos right here and then I'll, I'll also give they you They did not miss hand on one this shoe. This whole month. This is the first month. Crazy. No, I'm being serious, like this is the first month that we both agree like all the shoes is good. We don't even gotta do a recap at the end. <laughs> Cause we can just be like, buy them all. <laughs> <laughs> and look, in hand. That's crazy. So what do you think about the materials, the shape? Oh, the, it did this. <laughs> I love that. When I see it on the thing, when you with your voting thing, I see it, I was like, I like that. So, it's, so when you wear the shoe, the jack comes off. So As you keep way, wearing it. So the only way you can get the jack off is. <laughs> <laughs> keep playing in it. <laughs> <laughs> keep playing with it. <laughs> <laughs> but but yeah, you wear the shoe, it goes away. Right. But either way, what do you think overall? Like, remember we said we need to see the shoe in person. We need to see the no. At first, I was kind of like... sketch. Remember all the thing? I think I was kind of sketch mm -hmm. on the shoe. Mm -hmm. And in hand, I like the shoe. Like the materials. The materials is nice. Everything. Like this is nice. So the thing is, and they change it up a little bit. The around. insoles, like the toe box, like here. I $200, mean, two hundred dollars, two hundred dollars for a signature shoe that's not a Jumpman, and I don't. Uh, not a Jordan shoe or not a retro original model shoe mm -hmm. signature new model there's no air unit in here so I don't think it's an air Jordan it's just a Jordan right. so with that typically you pay more for having the air unit in there right so people are like you didn't you don't get this you don't get that they put cheaper insoles in here yeah. like this shoe should be 120 bucks 130 bucks but because of the name and the packaging, they got the special box and it comes with a little bag and everything. Oh, extra they had to put money into fill that. The, fill the box. I mean, like they said, it. oh, nice. you can hear it when you picked it yeah, up. It's nice, right? But either way, they're like, you got to compensate with all those things to make it justifiable for the $200 price point. And this is what we're expecting for this colorway right here. It's like the same tan kind of color. Oh, they white get, tan. Little, and then you got the red shoe. swoosh with the black instead oh, of the yeah, brown yeah. and everything. I really like this black. I was gonna say color. that one's a little better for I the like look. That. Yeah. This is not bad though. This these, is still these cool. Are clean. These are clean. Yeah, this is still rocker. So yeah, what do you think about I wouldn't you know me, I'm horrible. I would wear them. Yeah. I wouldn't really save them like that. Right. But I cause I guess trying see. to get that jack off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'd get mine off for sure. <laughs> Quick. <laughs> <laughs> Two minutes or last. <laughs> but uh no. Uh, you know. <laughs> you know how you ride your bicycle, you can you, you use your foot for a stop. <laughs> That's how I do it. That's okay. Uh no, but what was I gonna say? Oh they're supposed to be like, let's say I've seen about like five or six different colorways already. Right. And it makes me wonder, like, this is the first one. 
Are they going to come out with it? shiny thing. And then everything that comes out after that typically is what? Not as valued, not as whatever. It goes down over time. You know how that goes with yeah, all yeah, the new yeah. original stuff. Yeah. And that's classic to anything. But the question is, are these going to turn into like an era of fad type sneaker where this was a moment in time and there was a lot of demand around it then and then five years from now there's it doesn't have the longevity in it where people still desire it nah. or is it going to be one of the shoes that's like this is a staple in the game and it's going to have a stance for the next 10 15 20 years i think it'll get at least 10 years i think i'm that's interested how i feel because uh, his Air Max is in his trainers. Only if they make sure they don't flood the market. So this is supposed to be like a pretty limited release. If they do that, then they'll if they they'll win. On each release? On each release. I don't think they they're gonna do that. It low. It would take again if they do too much, they're not people's not gonna rush out and get it. Yeah. Because everybody got it. Right. And then now you gotta make a choice. Do I wanna spend two something for it? Two hundred and then a little uh, retail extra, a little extra. So so right now these are going for like five, six hundred bucks now. Originally they were twenty five hundred dollars a couple of months ago. Oosh. What they wasn't even out a couple of months ago. Well they did like a special drop for like the award show and everything. Oh that's right. And then why. they did like a really limited run. It was yeah. like literally like a couple hundred pairs of something like that. For the <laughs> build of the shoe. So now they were reselling for like twenty five hundred and then the price is like five hundred now, six hundred, somewhere around there. Um but I'm just interested to see because his Air Maxes and his other trainers and everything, they're going for like below retail. Well, the trainers are. And then the Air Maxes, they're going for a little bit. Well, over retail, maybe like double retail. Remember what I told you a couple months ago. If you keep collabing with the same people so many times, right, you're going to burn it out a little bit. So but it's I, not going to keep that same hype. I think yes and no, though. Because like Jordan is essentially collabing with himself, right? He's got all these models all these different things so like yeah, but that's is, jordan right but this is travis scott though and kanye is kanye like these dudes have set a huge foundation in the shoe game off-white is off-white right. you know what i'm saying like right. those three in particular have released bangers and not only just had samples like eminem and different people like that drake yeah. like drake's releases weren't there and they're all right you know but like eminem just got samples and pe so that don't really count you know what i'm saying right but these dudes like they drop fire stuff. They got fire stuff. It's showed the test of time from what's that, 2017, 2018 to now. Yeah. So like all that time in the game already, it's like they might be coming up on a 10 year mark soon. Right. Already. And that's what I said. I think they'll be good for the 10 by doing that. But you just gotta. For me, I like I keep saying, you gotta keep the release kind of low. You can't flood the market. I look at this shoe as literally, and I cannot predict. It can go two different ways. This shoe can eventually be. The original one from the first line of the Travis Scott's mm -hmm. and it's a fifteen hundred dollar shoe again. Or we could look years from down the line now and be like, damn, remember I was playing six hundred bucks for those when they came out and now they only one fifty? <clears throat> but I you think know what I'm saying? if you did that, yes, I understand. But if you did that, this colorway, another colorway, yeah, there's like this all navy colorway and then black one. Or <laughs> excuse me. <clears throat> Or came out with the set thing mm -hmm. where you did two pairs, mm -hmm. you know, and went ahead and knocked them over the head for the $400, 500 Right. And you did like a collab where you're doing both of them. People's going to rush to get that and keep it limited. Like the packaging. Yeah. 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 I don't know. I'm interested to see what happens in time. This is a dope shoe. I don't think this is the greatest shoe ever or anything like that. No, but you know, so like cool. I said before, I love trainers. I love the Revises. I love the trainer ones. Mm -hmm. I can list all the shoes that I like and uh, why I like this shoe. But uh, yeah, I don't know. Let me know what you guys think down below in the comments. These section. laces See right all the here. laces? Yeah, they got some. These are the too. Yeah. But yeah, Bro, let me know what y'all think. Uh, we got anything else before we go? Oh, we're going to Dallas. Where are we going? Dallas? Hey, we're going, we're going oh no, to we're going Boston. To, oh, we're going to Boston. That's where we're going. <laughs> I can't. We was just. Where was we? We was in like, Detroit. We was in Detroit. Then had to go somewhere else. And then we had a layover that was Dallas. Dallas. Yeah, that's what it was. The Dallas trip. From okay. <laughs> anyway, if this bit no, this video should be out right before the sneaker comes. Oh yeah, for sure. Okay. So, you guys, at the show at SneakerCon. Y'all gotta get more uh, signatures on my shirt. Y'all been <laughs> slacking. <laughs> my boy been beating me. Oh my God. <laughs> Hold on, let me get my shirt. <laughs> I don't have my shirt here, this but- Detroit. He got me from Detroit. Look at this. Oh yeah. 
Look at this. Oh yeah. Ah. I don't even know if they can see it all, but oh. yeah. Come on, y'all. Y'all gotta see your boy. You see me out there, y'all gotta get the signatures on my shirt, man. <laughs> see me. Anyway, but the people who have, I appreciate you. Thank you. Um, honestly, I love it. Cause I'm still just called DJ's dad, <laughs> but but that's a good thing. I appreciate that. Much love to everybody. And uh, this was the best month of shoes. Best month of the year so far, for sure. Best month, like you said, no recap. So Almost if, everything's a cop. You if you guys can size. only pick three shoes, let me know down below, maybe five. Let's just do five, because there's two. Yeah, oh, let's do shoes. three, you let's do ten. three. If you can only pick three shoes, what would they be? Let me know down below in the comment section. And uh, make sure you guys subscribe to his channel. Follow him on TikTok and Instagram and everything like that. We got to get him to 10K on all the platforms. And we're going to be posting another video of behind the scenes of some other shoes that are here in the office as well. So again, subscribe to his channel. Check it out. We got to get him to 10K ASAP. Appreciate anything else? Deuce. We out. Check my channel. All right, cool. All right. <laughs> I would never let you down. Yo, if you made it to the end of this video and want to take your collection to the next level, I built a full community with private meetups with me and other members in the community as well. So if you want to be a part of that and get early access or behind the scene looks on how I run my businesses, it's definitely going to be a place where I can help you scale your collection and potentially start investing in other things outside of sneakers like real estate. So hit the link down below in the description and get signed up and I'll see you guys on the inside. Listen, my DNA, hey, the hey, only hey, choice I like to Make what I'm aware today. I would never let you down. It's in my DNA. The only choice I like.